Hi guys, uh, just to give you an update on the purchase of our um, derelict farm. Uh, at the moment, um, we have to wait uh, two months for the uh, Societies of Land Development and Rural Establishment to establish whether they want to purchase the property um, because it's in use as agricultural property or was or has been in the past, but hasn't been in the past 10 years. So we're waiting for the decision whether they want to purchase it before us or or not. If they do, then that's it, no sale. So in the meantime, we've uh, we've had to dig deep and uh, buy another property or, or or put an offer in another property um, to um, live in and do up uh, as we go, as we wait, I suppose. Because the uh, the, the farm is um, uninhabitable at this time, um, this is the way forward. And uh, just having a look around the uh, the property that we are buying, it's just a two-bed two bed pavilion-type French-style property. Um, just walking around it now, um, there's a few things to be done. There's a bit of a damp issue, a bit of a roofing issue. Uh, at the moment but this is only minor from what i can see it's um it's in a nice residential area um yeah it, it, you know it's right for um renovation just a mild renovation uh, a bit of insulation here and there and uh yeah and when it comes to sell we'll sell that and move into the farm subject to planning permission because we, we've got so many things that we uh, we need to do to the farm to make it a viable business proposition. So if we can't get the relevant planning on the barns, then we'll have to change our plans accordingly. Uh, but uh, watch this space. So uh, click a like and subscribe if you want to follow us on this incredible stressful journey. Thanks very much. Nice it. Garage door. Front is the kitchen. 